here, sweetie. Let's get you fed. Come on. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Look at this beautiful baby goat. There. Ah. Uh, oh, breakfast time. Oh, we needed breakfast time. Yes, we did. That's her feed. Her breakfast. Three times a day. So it's morning time on Sunday. And I'm getting to her just a little bit late. And this is my sachet. Our sachet. She's a baby female goat. And a couple years from now, she'll be uh, supplying us with goat milk. So. Okay, there we go. Okay, here it comes, here it comes. <gasps> Three this morning. <sighs> Nothing like a bottle of warm milk. Uh oh, drinking too fast. Can't breathe this stuff, you know. at it so fast that she overwhelms her own little digestive system and other things. A happy little person when she's getting fed. She's actually a happy little person all the time. I should see her playing with the dogs. This is a very nice juxtaposition to my, my uh, technology life. It's feeding the baby. And taking care of my babies. Helping to take care of them. Taryn normally feeds Sasha. This morning she's over at a friend's house having a sleepover, which she loves. Gotta have our social time. About done? Did pretty well. That bottle's mostly empty. Yeah. It's very, very satisfying to have a full tummy. Is that good? Have you had enough? Have you had enough? Hmm? Have you had enough? Have you had enough? I just want some snuggle time. Hmm? Sachet is full. Oh, there it goes. Do we need to burp the baby? Hmm? Do we need to burp the baby? She likes a little snuggle time after eating. Oh, there it goes again. We need to burp the baby. Little go people are very, very sweet. They're very loving. They bond to anybody, gives them attention and food. It's still a little cold this time of year, and so even with the dog blanket on, she gets a little chilly. So a little warm milk and a little snuggling really, really satisfies her. Very sweet little person. Got two more pregnant gals, and so we should have a couple more baby goats here in just a few weeks. That'll be a handful trying to feed them at the same time. Yikes. 
and this guy, gal, will have playmates. They love to play. We've got a pile of rocks out there that uh, are going to be of particular interest to them. Okay, ready to get up? Okay, we're ready. Let's check and see if you want more milk, just in case. Need this a little more. Oh. <laughs> Up, up, up the tank. Okay, you ready? Ready for playtime? Hmm? Are you ready for playtime? Well, that's a full tummy you got there. Yeah, that's a full tummy. <laughs> Sasha. It's only um, she's a couple weeks old. She's kind of a runt. So she's a little small for a couple of weeks. The spots on top of her head are or uh, where her horns got burned off. So, kind of a sad process, but it only hurts them for just a little while. And then it goes away and then their horns don't grow up. That's important because they get, the horns get caught in the fence and they hurt themselves sometimes, kill themselves, and so we just have to take off the horns and, or uh, prevent them from growing more specifically. So, are you ready for play? Hmm? I'm just more snuggling. Hmm? <laughs> Alright, I'll say bye to everybody. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs>